This is not the story of a bike fueled by performance specs and outrageous horsepower statistics. Rather this is the story of a bike engineered to fan the flame of imagination that got us into motorcycling to begin with, in the hope that it can spark that same flame in some new riders. Yamaha's new XSR700 speaks to me because it wasn't so long ago I was the target demographic for this bike. I spent my high school years hanging out at motorcycle shops looking at the boxy outlines of then discarded Japanese relics collecting dust in the back corners of showrooms. At the time, the renaissance of the 1970s UJM was still a few years away. I loved the style of those old Japanese machines. I pictured myself with a bike of my own, covered in grease and working late nights in my parents' garage to bring it back. When it finally kicked to life, I dreamed I would ride away with the girl on the back. It would be like when Adrian Greenier rode through the halls of his high school in The Adventures of Sebastian Cole. The only problem was I didn't know how to work on bikes, nor did I have a girl let alone the girl, and let's face it ladies and gentlemen, I am no Adrian Greenier. Needless to say, I like the idea of bikes that pay homage to their roots. The XSR700 shares similarities to the stylistic lines that defined a generation of machines while being powered and controlled by modern, reliable technology. Bikes like these allow new riders to get into the sport with a motorcycle that pleases the eye and encompasses the essence of cool.